It's been a painful 20 months for the family of Ramin Rose Thurston. No mother should have to go through um, what I've just been through. Ramin was killed from a motorcycle crash on 5th Street in 2020. I was in shock. I was actually sitting home waiting for him to come home. His grandmother, Arlene, said his life was just getting started. She says she visits this memorial often in his gravesite every day. But it's an empty space at home and it's an empty space in my heart. But this day, uh, revealing something positive for Ramin's family and friends. Who we did it, Ramin. Ramin's mom, Binta, tears brought to her eyes and she herself brought to her knees when she saw this sign. Just thanking God for this day that I'm able to put a sign up with my son's name on it, his memory. A new roadside memorial, Ramin's name printed boldly and the message, drive safely. I hope they know to slow down and be safe and it could be Dow Child and they will be going through what we've gone through. The city launched this roadside memorial program last year. Binta had created a petition months ago, working with the city's traffic engineer to do something about Fifth Street safety. She helped bring the speed limit down five miles per hour. It looks like it's some progress moving. Ramin's family and friends will feel their loss for the rest of their lives, with hopes that maybe others can gain something. I just to remember, um, when you drive this stretch of road, just be safe and look out for others. It's just my number one, what I want to advocate for. In Charlottesville, Carly Haynes, CBS 19 News.